Hi everybody, we're David and Zipporah from Camp Shane and tonight we're going to look at snacks. Snacks I think are always a challenge for kids, don't you? Absolutely. And the thing that we'd like you to take away from this is you got a snack. It's just a question of having the right snack, a healthy snack. And Diane Hendricks, our celebrity chef and dietitian in the kitchen, is going to show you some wonderful options. dietitian in the kitchen and I'm here with Hannah, one of the campers from Camp Shane and we're going to talk about snacks today. Uh, first I want to show you some great options for snacks. You really want to try to make your own snacks and not fall into buying those convenience foods that you don't know what's in there. You want to control your own salt, sugar and fat in your food so just try to make some of these snacks at home and then you can grab them and go. First we have trail mix. You can never go wrong with trail mix. It's a mixture of nuts and cereals and grains and all kinds of different stuff peanut butter on a whole grain waffle with some fresh fruit. You cannot go wrong, it's so delicious. You can just fold it in half like a taco and off you go. Cut up fresh fruit with a yogurt dip. Uh, yogurt is a great foundation to make a fruit dip and kids love to dip so it's really wonderful. And cheese and crackers, you get the calcium and all the great nutrients and the vitamins in, in uh, cheese and you're, you're ready to go. So we're gonna make some blueberry muffins. Healthy blueberry muffins or any kind of muffin are a really good quick grab and go snack. Okay, so first we're going to do, you're going to whisk up the, the wet ingredients, and I'm going to do the dry ingredients. So, yep, I can even do it. You start whisking, okay? You can start whisking in an empty bowl, because then as it comes, there you go. So you're going to whisk up, we have some egg whites. We have some sour cream. Whisk it hard, hon. Huh? Use those muscles you got. Okay, we've got a little bit of canola oil, which is a health, hard, healthy oil. And you don't want to use olive oil when you're baking, because you really don't want your blueberry muffins to taste like olives, do you? <laughs> No? Okay. <laughs> got a little vanilla extract. Honey. You can't go wrong with honey. You can use some agave nectar or any type of uh, maple syrup. You don't need a lot. Keep going. Faster, faster, faster. And a little milk. Milk gives you nine essential nutrients. Very, very good for you. You always want to, uh, to make sure you get at least three servings of dairy a day. Okay. You keep doing that. And over here, I've got some flour. Get it nice because you got to get those egg whites really moving around, okay? So I've got flour. I've got oats. Oats are a great builder for baked goods. Some baking powder. You can stop if you want. Some baking powder. Some cinnamon. Some nutmeg. And toasted wheat germ and flaxseed, a combination of the two. You can't go wrong. Okay, then I'm just going to combine that. I'm going to make like a nice little well in here. Let me do some more flour. I'm going to make a nice little well in here, and you're going to dump the wet ingredients right into the center there. So you start pouring the wet ingredients in, and you're just going to incorporate them. And I just lightly stir. You're just going to want to kind of fold it around. You don't want to over mix it. Very good. I think that's good. I think we got a nice, yep, that's good. So now we have this nice batter for these delicious muffins. And what else do we need? What's missing out of these? Blueberries. Blueberries. There we go. Can you dump these in? <laughs> okay. Just start dumping them in. There we go. That's good. So we've got, you can't go wrong with the blueberries either. If you don't like blueberries, you can use dried cranberries, you can use strawberries. I make pineapple muffins, you name it, it's delicious. So we're gonna take these, dump them into a greased muffin tins, and they rise because you got that baking powder in there. And you just fill them all up, and you stick them in the oven. And then you'll just bake them in the oven, and what you end up with, if you use a bigger tin, is you end up with these delicious muffins. You wanna break a piece off the front? They're so good. So try it. How is it? You can't go wrong with muffins, guys. Remember, you don't want to go more than three hours without eating something. You want to keep that metabolism going and keep yourself strong for the day. Thanks for watching.